you for giving me your call. Give me another one. Thank you. You're so sweet. Not me. You did a good job. You did a good job. You did. Okay. Shake. I'm old, I can't get up. My knees, my knees are giving out on me, y'all. You know, we gotta make a good impression on these new people that we gonna meet. Today's the day we're gonna go to our Airbnb. And you're gonna meet your new best friend. You're, there's a dog there, you know that? Gizmo's actually the submissive dog. Any dog he meets, he is submissive to. Sounds like me and my relationships. <laughs> Gotta get that chest, boy. Gotta get that chest, you know what I'm saying? Gotta get the neck, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> uh, see, it wasn't that bad. All right, my turn. Gotta go get ready. So we're still a couple hours away from the Airbnb, so we do have some time to spare before I check in. So what I'm gonna do is take Gizmo for a little walk. For those who have been following me and pay attention to detail, have you guys noticed anything different about me? No? Since y'all don't see nothing different about me. I got two new tattoos, uh, which is this one here. I'm putting some ointment on it right now. It is in the healing process. I got that one, and I also got this one here on my chest. All right, so let me explain to you what these tattoos mean. So this tattoo right here is Cupid, blindfolded, shooting towards my heart. Because y'all already know love is blind. People ignore the signs, people ignore the red flags, people do it for the sake of love, and I am one of those people, I'm sorry. I follow my heart, regardless. And I have no regrets with anybody I've been with, anybody I've dated, married, <laughs> been in a relationship with, I have no regrets. This right here, sorry for the redness. My neck is sensitive, so whenever I rub on there, it just turns red. There's a whole bunch of stars. It's actually the constellation of Pisces, because I'm a fish. All right, let me stop fucking around. Let me finish getting ready, and I'm gonna take this dog out for a walk before we start heading off on the road. Whatever park this is, it is so freaking nice. Really? 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 All over that plant. God damn. Look at all the geese, Gizmo. Look at the geese. Good boy. Who's scared of heights? Ain't nobody scared of heights today. Oh, that's why you had to poop, huh? That shit is cool. That tree broke, and look how it landed on top of the creek. The way things fall apart naturally still looks gorgeous. All right, Gizmo. Look, this too right here. Check this tree out. I don't know why it's growing out like that, and it's white. I don't know if that means it's dead or something. I don't know nothing about it. Wind just came out of nowhere and just blew me in the face. It just felt so good and so free. Moments like this is what I was looking for. Moments like this. I had to really take that wind in before I took out the camera. It's coming again, it's coming again. Moments like these. Moments like these is what I'm looking for. Gizmo's missing the whole view. He just wants to pee everywhere. Every little spot he finds, he wants to piss at. He's missing the view. Come on, Gizmo, look at this. Look at that. You don't care. You're just ready to go. I'm sorry, but I'm not. You're gonna have to give me a second. This is so sad. Oh, I wish we could find him. Poor doggy. They probably let him off the leash because they wanted him to roam and shit. Look what happened. Uh, I don't do that shit. Sometimes I drink too much. Sometimes I test your tricks. Sometimes I don't know why you stay with me. I'm hard in love. Oh, 
tell me. arrived to my Airbnb I have my GoPro on because I will show you as I'm walking through the house I already walked in I met up with the owner and you know what this house is bigger than I thought it was gonna be hold on let me clean y'all <gasps> hold on I can't have you guys watch me through through a dirty lens I actually have two roommates but the male is going to move out next week so I won't, I won't see him much. Um, my other roommate is a woman. She has a dog. It's gonna be Gizmo's best friend, okay? There's lots of parking. Uh, parking there, parking there. First thing I noticed right away, which I love, 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 is this sign. We believe black lives matter, no human is illegal, love is love, women's rights are human rights, science is real, water is life. Okay, come on now. The only problem I have today is the weather. It's, it's raining. It's, it's a little messy. It's okay though. Both of my roommates are not home right now, but they work first shift. I will be working second shift. I am going to show you the cribbo. It's a little cluttered, only because um, the female roommate will be moving out months from now, so she's getting all her shit together. And it's a little dark in there. I don't know where all the switches are. I'm trying. Just bear with me. That's what I'm trying to say. Let's go ahead and show you the house. <laughs> Gizmo, you walked in before me. Excuse me. Excuse me. This area here is considered, I don't know. I really don't know what this is. This house has a little bit of an old school vibe. This is actually the dining room area. It's a cute little table. I, you guys, this is the type of shit I like. This is my type of vibe. I'm telling you, this is the shit that I like. I don't like, I don't want no fancy mansion, no. Like I said, it's cluttered because the roommate is gonna be moving out in a few months. This is the living room couch the tv um oh they got some wine bottles up in this bitch Ooh. i don't know about living with strangers but i'll drink with them if they want to what else we got yeah so this is the back i'm not gonna go in um uh, back there it's wet they do have some tiki sticks we can light that up I'm not a smoker, I probably won't be out there much unless my roomies wanna invite me for a drink or two. I'm gonna try to be social. Excuse me, excuse me. Gizmo, move. Thank you. I gotta change. I gotta change my ways. It's okay to be an introvert, but, ooh, what is it? These are the things that we use for wine, okay. It's okay to be an introvert, but I wanna socialize a little bit more. This is the kitchen. Um, like I said, she's storing some stuff. I like this. This is the laundry room. The owner wants us to only do laundry once a week just for the water bill so it won't be so crazy. But if we have to, she said it's fine to do it twice if needed. All right. I don't know what else is here. Okay, we have a, we have a, we have a little bathroom in here. Okay, Gizmo, let's go upstairs. Ready? Let's go up, go. 
the boy. That's my dog. I apologize that it's dark, guys. I don't know what the switches are. Um, so this bedroom belongs to one of the roommates. We do have locks on the door. Um, this is the female roommate that's moving out in a few months. I, I do believe they got the biggest rooms, which is fine, no big deal. And this is the bathroom where I, where I will be showering. I haven't even looked in here yet. Okay, cool, cool. Like I said, I don't need much in my life to be happy. I love this, I love this, I love this. This is my room. I actually saw this um, in the Airbnb post and I think I thought it was so adorable. The only thing I find a little odd is that she still had, they still have their belongings in my space. <laughs> Does that make sense? I feel like they should have emptied this out for me, but you know, it is what the fuck it is. This is gonna work. I love the rug. It's nice and fluffy. You know, it's like in the, you know, it's like the 70s. I love that shit. Gizmo, are you happy? Are you happy? Is it better than the hotel? Remember, you're scared of heights. Come on. Come on. You're just gonna stay up there all day? So that is the house, and you probably won't meet my roommates. I don't wanna throw a camera in their faces. <laughs> it's kinda weird. We are strangers, so. All right. How do I feel about this house so far? I did not expect for it to be this big. I love that there's a lot of space where we're not crowded into one. Cause like I said, I am an introvert and being an introvert does not mean shy. It just means you just get a lot of your energy and a lot of your uptime when you're alone. I just have a feeling this is gonna be this is gonna be a good assignment. And as of right now, I love where I'm staying. The way everything's set up, kind of like cluttered, kind of like hoarding, I ain't gonna lie to you. <laughs> but I kind of love this vibe because it reminds me of my childhood. I grew up in a trailer park with my family. We're a family of eight. And we're real close to my cousin's family. They're a family of 10. And they lived a few trailers down and Honestly, the way the vibe is here, it reminds me of my cousin's trailer. I'm really bit big on energy, and the second I drove up to the house and walked in, I felt nothing but positive energy. Even with the owner, positive energy. So this is a, this is a good start for me. I'm glad you like it, baby. I'm glad. Yes. Oh, you're so fucking cute. Hold on, baby, let me see. You're so cute. I love the way that I packed. It was perfect. I just finished unpacking. It was so easy. The only thing I learned unpacking is wherever I go, I don't think I'm gonna hang anything. I hung some of my items. That is, I don't know, the owners or something. I wasn't provided enough hangers, so I had to pretty much put everything in these drawers. Which is fine. That taught me something. Wherever I go, I think it's just best to keep everything folded and just put them in, their, in the dressers and the drawers. That way the, the items I don't use, they're still folded and I can just throw them in my luggage whenever it's time for me to go to another location. It'll be easier that way. I have my jeans, pants, shirts in this dresser. This is what I use to pack when I pack my luggages. As you can see, they're pretty much my boxer briefs, sports bras, socks. I decided to keep them in their bags. I do want to stay at a home, away from home. I do want to be comfortable. At the same time, it is not my home. So I do want to make things easier and convenient. I have my bathroom items that I will be putting in inside the bathroom. I'm going to keep all my shoes in that bag. Whatever I need, I will take it out. And all my empty luggages, I did put in here. So, and I also have my two suitcases there. That is Gizmo's bag. I'm keeping all his stuff in his bag. I don't let him sleep on the bed with me at home. So he does have this bed with his blanket next to me. But I think from time to time, I will have him sleeping, in, sleeping on this bed with me because this ain't my bed. And all these sheets can be claimed by the owner, not by me, okay? I don't gotta pay utilities. I don't gotta pay housekeeping, you know what I'm saying? Everything's taken care of. I love this. Rise and shine, mother cluckers. <laughs> and I did bring my lighting uh, for my reaction videos. I decided to put all my hats on top of this dresser. And in here are my jackets. So this is my setup on the desk. I have my two table lightings. 
my camera that I will be using to, to do reaction videos along with the mic, my laptop, and of course, motherfuckers, had to bring my Bliss Uncensored cup, you know? Have my planner. This helps me a lot. Fun fact about me, my memory is bad. It is horrible. I have not started my assignment yet, but I'll keep you guys updated and see and let you know how everything is going. All right, that's enough of me talking because I get tired. I get tired. All right, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe, and please hit that bell so you can get notified every time I upload. See you in the next vlog. Peace.